What's up, my name is Alex Costa, and today we are going over one of my favorite topics ever, shoes. Guys, you know how much I love shoes. You've seen some of my favorite shoes, my collection. It's all over TikTok, if you're not following me there. I've been posting there every single day. Every single day, there's a new TikTok. It's listed below, all right? No matter where you're stepping into next, I got you covered because today, I'm gonna give you guys the five types of shoes that every man needs in his closet. If you have these five types of shoes in your closet, then you are good, my friend. You're ready for any occasion. I'm talking about high-end events, going to the grocery store, playing sports, all of that. You're gonna be covered. So, let's get started. And by the way, if you like today's video, if you enjoy the, the atmosphere here, then make sure to click that subscribe button below. Here we talk about men's fashion, men's hair, men's grooming, fitness, dating advice, and so much more. We have close to three million subscribers, and I would love to have you here, so join the family. The number one shoe that every man needs to have in his closet. If you guys are longtime subscribers, you know this one all white leather sneakers. Man, if you've been a part of the family here, then you know I've said this a few times before. Every man needs a pair of white sneakers. White sneakers just work with literally everything that you have in your closet. It is insane how versatile and how much you're going to use and wear these white sneakers. Now, you can wear them to the beach wearing swim trunks. You can wear them with a suit if you're trying to look cool and different and not be too stuffy. You can wear them to go get groceries. We, it's literally endless. The options are endless when it comes to white sneakers. They are so versatile. If you buy clean white sneakers right now, and by clean, I mean just the design, no logos, no stripes or anything like that, you can literally bust them out 10 years from today and they'll still look good if you keep them clean, of course, because they're classics. They're never going away. It's not a trend, it's just here to stay. They look great and there's so many affordable options that work for different occasions. You can spend 50 bucks on white sneakers, you can spend $800 on like Saint Laurent uh, white sneakers. It's basically the same thing. They all do the same job. So I'm gonna leave a list below of all of the shoes that I mentioned in this video so you guys can go do some shopping if you like them. Number two, every man needs nice dress shoes. I don't understand the guys that rent dress shoes to go somewhere, are you kidding me? You're gonna spend all of that money renting shoes so that you can wear it once and then maybe wear it once again the next month and have to pay again? No, 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 no. I'm gonna tell you exactly what you need to do. You need one pair of nice dress shoes that are black. That will match basically all of the outfits that you have in your closet. And if you want a second pair, go for brown. A dark brown, nice chocolate dark brown. Perfect. With those two, you're gonna be able to wear any types of suits, any colors, any formal outfits that you have. My advice to you is make sure they're clean or you can go for like double mocks if you really wanna change it up. Just make sure they're comfortable because if they're uncomfortable and you're standing up in a wedding or whatever it is that you wear, any type of event, right? You're standing up for hours sometimes. Walk around in them, break them in because if they're uncomfortable, that's gonna hurt because they tend to be a little bit on the stiff side. So make sure to break them in before you wear them the first time. I like to move mine around with my hands or sometimes I put uh, a shoe tree in there to keep the shape. Just break them in before you wear them. Next up, the type of shoes that I wear the most because I don't really go anywhere right now because things are closed. <laughs> Uh, gym sneakers. I work out every single morning, no matter if I do it at home or if I go outside to do it, I wear my training or running sneakers, right? And being active every day is key to living a healthier lifestyle. Especially nowadays, you need to make sure that you're living a healthy lifestyle. There's a lot happening outside right now, so make sure that you're healthy. Now, whether you're a gym guy, you're an athlete, or maybe you just like running or jogging lightly outside, my recommendation would be make sure that you're buying the right type of sneakers for the activity that you like to do, the activity that you're doing the most. So if you go to the gym and you're lifting heavy, you want a flat bottom, a flat sole, so that you can have all the support you need to lift the heavy weights at the gym. If you're going running, you need something that is extra light, extra comfortable, extra bouncy. If you do a lot of high intensity training, then you need something that's a little bit of a hybrid. It needs to give you the support that you need, but it also needs to be light and flexible. If you play a lot of basketball, you need something that's probably gonna give you more support, basketball sneaks. So one of the few good things about this pandemic and what's happening outside right now is 
There are a lot of sales online right now. I've been on Nike.com, Adidas.com, and man, there are some insane sales. You can get really, really nice sneakers for less than 75 bucks on those websites from those amazing brands. So I'm gonna leave a few options for you guys listed in the description below. I'm telling you guys, you don't need to spend hundreds of dollars on these sneakers. You know, Nike, Adidas, Puma, they make sneakers that are a hundred bucks and they're mostly on sale right now. Plus, you know that if you look good, it kind of motivates you to go to get outside, to get exercising, you know? I know that if I have a new uh, workout outfit or new sneakers, I'm like, all right, I'm gonna work out today, I'm gonna wear them, I look good, I feel good. It motivates you, it gets you going. Number four, your daily sneakers. Look, I, <laughs> I used to wear my training sneakers all the time, like running sneakers with jeans when I was in my early 20s. It was not a good look, and I really hope that you guys aren't doing the same. Training sneakers, workout sneakers are for working out. They do not look good, even with a casual basic outfit. You have the white sneakers for that. But besides the white sneakers, you should also have your dailies or your, your beaters. You know, I'm talking about your Vans, I'm talking about your Converse. Those sneakers are amazing because one, they're very affordable and you can find them in pretty much every footwear store out there and online. And two, they're comfortable, everyone knows what they are. Even though people look at the Vans and say, hey, I know, this is a, an affordable sneaker. People don't think this is cheap because Vans, that's a good brand, right? Converse, that's Nike, that's an amazing brand. And most people own those sneakers. No matter, Actually, even girls own Vans and Converse. These are the sneakers that if you're wearing something like this, right, you just kind of want to be comfy. I want to be comfy for today's video. For this outfit right now, I'm barefoot, but if I was going outside, I would throw on my Converse. I would throw on my Vans and it would look good with this outfit. It's such an easy sneaker to, to wear, to mix and match. It pretty much goes with everything in your closet. You don't have to think about it. You're wearing a casual outfit, grab one of those two and you're good. Number five, guys, there are some sneakers that you need like the dress shoes, the white sneakers, you know, the super casual Vans, etc. But you know what, for number five, you gotta go with something personal, something fun, a pair that you relate with, something that really makes your fashion speak for itself, makes your personality shine through your sneakers. Some guys like to go all high beast and get some Yeezys or get some Nike Auto Adapt, you know, but no matter what, it's not about the money, it's not about how much you paid for them and how hard they are to get, it is exactly what you're trying to show with your sneakers, what type of guy you are, what type of person you are. Because we know that sneakers, they say a lot about the person who's wearing them. So get something for you. Get something that gets you excited to put them on and go outside. Get something that makes you and your style really shine through. And most importantly, get something that your friends don't have. I just, I really don't like the idea of like the groups of friends that walk together and dress the exact same. It's just weird to me. I think people should have their own unique type of style. I get that some things overlap, but be yourself. Even if if it's from an unknown brand, if you buy something on Amazon that we've never heard of and it looks cool, it's comfortable, go for it, man, get it. That is what style is all about, so don't be afraid to show yours. Well, don't be afraid to show your, your style. That's what I mean, don't show us anything else. Guys, like I said, I listed a bunch of these shoes in the description below, go check them out. And of course, thank you guys so much for watching. You know, I know the quarantine has been, has been tough, and you know, the content on this channel is about going out, looking good, meeting new people, dating, etc. And it's it's been really tough, but I really appreciate you guys hanging in here with me while we, we wait safely for the return of, you know, bars and schools and movie theaters. Man, I, I am craving to go and do those things. So thank you guys. I really appreciate you sticking with me and supporting me over the years. Uh, I just wanted to take a second here to speak to you from the heart. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace.